Guess what? It's me again. The old crown dances. Hi, family and friends. Set my timer. Part two. Dollar Tree grocery haul. Did get my coffee made. Got my sausage put away in the freezer. Oh, that's good. You know, I can drink coffee half a pot at night and go to bed, no problems. And spirits the same way. Yeah, okay. <laughs> my cat. I brought these from Dollar Tree to cover up. Thought I was getting smart to cover up my coffee mug. He is trying to bat them off of my coffee because he likes to drink my coffee. And I don't want him in my coffee. And I'm afraid he's going to spill it. So, I think I'm going to have to get down to the point where I just pour him a little of my coffee in a saucer and he likes his caffeine, I guess, so. At any rate, yeah, my cat's different. So, alright, here we go. I got just to go. <coughs> I um, usually don't buy this kind of stuff. I buy peanut butter, but not these little packets. You get three packets. But the reason I got this was um, from my bug out bag that I'm putting together. I'll do a video on that when I get it all done. It's going to take me a while though because um, I've got to have the money to buy, you know, some of the, like the sleeping bag and my tent, whatever. My son's guiding me. So, um, yeah. He says I have to be ready in case we have to go. So, it's like, okay. So, at any rate, um, well, you never know. But I thought these would good, be good, you know, because peanut butter's good. So, that's the reason I got this. This is especially for that. And like I say, sometime I will do a video of my bug out bag when I get it together. I tie in shreds, two cups, which is pretty good for a dollar to get two cups of che shredded cheese. It's the Sunny Acres 8 ounce cholesterol free. Uh, so I got, let's see, not that one, two, three, four, five, Seven. I should have gotten eight. There should be one more pack of the Italian because I thought I brought eight packs because I um, I use a lot of this or mozzarella, whatever you know. But um, I think this was a little cheaper way for me to go. Um, the buying big big bag so because it was almost nine dollars for two pounds nine dollars for two pounds so I spent eight dollars and I got eight two would make two so four pounds so yeah for eight dollars I got four pounds and for nine dollars I would have gotten two pounds at Fairway so it was a much better deal to buy them like this. And uh, then I got the two cup Mexican shreds. This is from a tacos that I'm making tomorrow. So that's that bag. Yeah, it's quite a price difference, yeah, right? I think I'm right on my calculations there. Ugh. And I probably will continue my grocery haul since I feel like sometimes you guys could go do my shopping for me without a list. But anyway, you never know. But then I find new things like this, you know, and I want to show it. So, although I've seen these hauled, they did have the orange. <laughs> so I like orange. Um, the Crush Orange, they're the Soft Chewy Twisted Candy Bites, 3 ounce made with real orange crush so um i got one of them try that out and then they had the um hawaiian punch ones the fruit juicy 
soft, chewy, twisted candy bites made with Hawaiian Punch, three ounce. So, then there's another orange crush, but these two aren't mine. The one orange crush is mine. And that they had no raisins. I wanted to get about three boxes of raisins. And uh, they had none. Another one of those red vine twists. That's not mine either. I got one for myself, but that one's not mine. And then I got uh, another pack of the chicken stuffing mix by Chef Carlin. And it's six ounce. And this is pretty good dressing. So I got another one because um, I was out of dressing. And then I got, I think I got six of these. I wanted the traditional, but they only had mushroom and meat. Uh, but it's the Hunt's Pasta Sauce with Mushroom. And it's the uh, one pound, eight ounce. And these are pretty good. I always buy these. You know, as my starter base for my, like my pasta sauce. But I spiff these up. By the time I'm done, mm -mm, they're not this. But this is my starter base of how I make my spaghetti sauce. So, um, I got six cans of that. Okay. A couple packs of the Boston baked beans. These aren't mine either. Thought my son was coming back, but I don't know what he's doing. But well, they're here. I got two of these uh, uh, Sweet Mate uh, 100 packets, 3.5 ounce net weight. And it's comparable to Sweet and Low. Now they do have. The Splenda one of this, that's uh, the you know dupe for Splenda, and uh, but you only get 50 packets, and this is working fine for me. I only use one pack of this compared to the Splenda where I'd use two. For some reason, this doesn't seem sweet enough, so I get two packs of, of uh, that sweetener, and then. Oh, there's my other pepperoni. Yeah, I thought I brought four of them. Or three of them, or whatever. I don't know. Sunny Sea Peak Salmon in Water. Skinless and boneless. It's a rich source of omega-3, and it's a three-ounce packet. And I got three of them. And uh, this is for Bug Out Bag. I was looking for tuna because I thought they also carried tuna, but they only had the pink salmon. So I went ahead and got that because I thought this would be good for the bug out bag. So I just have to uh, go. This is good through December 31st of 2017. So I mean, this has got a long shelf life on it. And, uh, you know, I'll just have to eventually eat these. And then uh, um, replace them in time. You know, I have to rotate. But for right now, I don't think I have to worry for, or I don't like to use the word worry. I don't like that. I don't like the way it sounds. Concerned. I don't have to be concerned about them expiring for a while. So, at any rate, um, got that. Okay. Let's see. I showed that. This one. Oh, this might be. Yeah, this is just my other four cans of the uh, mushroom pasta sauce. Ooh, we might get through this like no tomorrow then. So we're going. We got one more bag left. Not too bad. Oh. Hello. Well, actually, this is all stuff I've showed. Another, the, my second box of the creamer and three more bottles of this. 
so I guess we did pretty good if I had a few more minutes left on that um, without that camera going out we could have gotten this all on one video um, I do hope you guys if you have it go and watch my video that I put up of a uh, friend mail that I got from Sarah Rowley um, something different and especially what's part two um, part two is the big thing um, I was so shocked and in awe of of what she got me <laughs> I mean it was like wow it's like a watch all right guys I am gonna have uh, probably at least one more small grocery haul because I've got to go through my grocery list and go probably up to Walmart and pick up what I couldn't find at the other stores and um, uh, I do have a lot of online orders coming in well not a lot but I got a shop miss a coming and uh, a bang good coming and uh, some other place coming Anyway, I've got a few, um, and somewhere else, I think. And I'm about ready to place another Shop Miss A order, actually. <laughs> Probably have it placed by tomorrow before the other one gets here. I love that place. If you guys have not checked out Shop Miss A, um, you should go check it out. Everything is a dollar, regardless of what it is, with the exception of their floating charm, um, the bracelet. That's charms. The the necklace you can get either in a necklace key tape chain bracelet or I don't know they have have it in several different but it's the locket that holds the floating charms the, those are five bucks and I need to get one of those but I'm finding that I'm not as crazy about the floating charms because of my vision it's really 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 hard for me to see them um, I am gonna make one and it's gonna be one a family one and that's going to be it but yeah as I showed um, this charm bracelet is near completion you know as I've showed in my other videos and I'm, I'm in the process of putting another spell of charm bracelet together and then um, it's probably going to be another one because I like dangle charms I like anything dangly so um at any rate, yeah, that stuff should be coming in sometime this week, I, you know, for sure. So, there'll be more videos for that stuff. Later. Have a good day.